A person can die from blood loss within five minutes. If you find yourself in an emergency situation, call 911 or direct someone else to. Then you can take life-saving action while waiting for help to arrive. First, try to find the source of the bleeding. A person could be injured in multiple places, and clothing can hide where the bleeding is coming from. Look at the arms, legs, neck, armpits, groin, and midsection. Look for continuous bleeding, large volume bleeding, or pooling of blood. Now cover the injury with gauze or cloth. Maybe you have a towel or extra t-shirt with you. And apply direct pressure to the wound. This may stop the bleeding, but you should keep pressure on the wound until help arrives. For a deeper wound, you may need to pack the injury with gauze or cloth until it stops bleeding. Then apply pressure until help arrives. If bleeding continues, you may need to use a tourniquet. Remember, a properly used tourniquet hurts. Be sure to let the injured person know. Apply the tourniquet above the wound, high and tight on the arm or leg. It's okay to place it over clothing. Now tighten the tourniquet until the bleeding stops. Do not remove the tourniquet. A second tourniquet may be needed to stop the bleeding. When help arrives, an emergency responder will take over. Be ready to help them by answering their questions. In an emergency, minutes matter. And the most basic education can save lives and improve outcomes in our community.